Here's problem number 29, and it says every one of these points uh, on the coordinate grid are, the vertices are all integers, so we know they hit right on the point. And it says, which statement's true? Now remember, that means similar. That means the ratio of the sides to the other guy's sides, everybody's either expanded or contracted at the same rate. You put it on a, put it on a Xerox machine, it's gonna blow up all the sides at the same rate. One's not gonna stay while the others blow up. So when we look at this, I noticed that from here to here, that B to C, that is a length is one. I noticed straight up to D from B to D, that leg is two. So this little triangle right here of B, C, D is, has one, two, and then that'd be a square root of five. But we're not gonna worry about that as long as the legs match. Notice that every one of these triangles is 90 degrees right here. And they're asking us to figure out which ones are similar. So I know that they all are 90 right in the center between these legs that we're going to be able to get. Now again, let's go with what the length is here. One, two, three. So this leg is three from here to here. And then here down, if I count, is going to give me six. Now it wants me to compare this triangle right here to this guy to this guy. Now I quickly notice that this B to C to D is a one, two. For every one this guy is, the other leg is twice as big. But notice on this one, for every two, this guy's three as big. I see that this B, C, D is not, there's no way it's gonna match up with this guy that's three, two. It's a two, three, this is a one, two, it's a half. For every inch this is, its length is twice as much. But for this guy, for every two this is, it's one and a half times as much. So I see that these choices right here with A, B, D and some of the others, anything with A, B, D is not going to be a possibility because it's not going to match anybody. I notice that this is 1 to 2 and notice this leg is 3 to 6, which is the ratio 1 to 2, isn't it? So if I'd set this up in proportion, I see this 1 corresponds to 3 is 2 corresponds to 6 and those are going to work. But your mind should notice that the half and the three six match up. Now the key is putting it in correct order. Which of these, because these both say that they're similar to one another, but which one puts in the correct order? Now remember, our 90 degree angle is right here and here. This says C to B to D. C to B to D. That's the one to the 90 to the two. So the short side to the 90 to the two, congruent to the A, B, E, which is the short side to the 90 to the 6, that's going to be it right there. It's going to be choice C. Notice this doesn't work if you say 1, the short side to the 90 to the 2, so short to the 90 to the longer side, to the E to B, that's the long side to the 90 to the short. We want to keep it short to the long, short to the long, so we see that it's got to be option C here on problem number 29.